Hi Sagittarius, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and this is your spirit message. This is just an extra little message, whatever spirit wants you to know. This is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, however you want it, whenever it resonates. If this doesn't resonate, then so be it. This is a spirit message for Sagittarius. What do we need to tell them tonight? Choices, decisions, confusion. It's really, you know, be careful where, what you choice, choose or how you act because what you own owns you. It's all up to you. That's what this card says. This is the Seven of Cups. When the Seven of Cups comes out, it means that you're trying to do too much at one time and you have to beware of your thoughts at this time, okay? Your thoughts impact your life, okay? Choose wisely. What you own, owns you. The second one is the sun or the light. This is happiness. This is enlightenment, Sagittarius. Sagittarius, it's enlightenment. I was trying to combine the words, apparently. Um, this is the four of swords. It's time to, to recuperate. This says regess. <coughs> having a hard time tonight. Rest and rejuvenate. Okay, rest and rejuvenate. Take the time you need. Don't try to rush. Okay, when you have to make this decision, whatever it is, any decisions in your life, take the time you need to make them. Don't rush into them. Don't be impulsive. Okay, um, always make the decision that's going to make you happy in the future. Okay, don't make the decisions based on now. Always think about the future. Okay, <laughs> this is also uh, the death of an idea, so it can mean that you have to let something go. So something, I think it's a thought, and I think it has to do with with negativity. And this is positivity. This is negativity. This is positivity. So you need to replace negativity with positivity. All right. Of course. So we have the tower and we have transformation. So the thing is, is disruption comes into your life to open your eyes. Okay? It feels like the decisions that you have made, some of them impulsively, haven't served you so well. And now it's time to become enlightened based on those past decisions and and let something go, let go of the past, let go of you, let go of the old you because all it's been doing is causing some kind of disruptions, okay? And with these disruptions, it's really opened your eyes, okay? This tower comes in because there's been some false um, foundations in your life. There's been breakdowns, one right after another, okay? There's been some breakdowns in your life that were coming in to wake you up, to enlighten you, okay? So now it's time for you to be successful again. It's time for you to get your life back on track. It's time for you to start over, okay? This is a new beginning, all right? It's time for you to go through your transformation, and that has to do with replacing negative with positive. There's been some lies here, okay? This is the devil. There's been some lies. <clears throat> You've been sent these hurdles to wake you up, to make you successful, believe it or not. I know that's hard to believe, but it's true. I feel like you have been clinging to the past, all right, and there could be an opportunity even now 
that somebody from your past could come back into your life and offer you love or you're wanting to offer love from to somebody from your past. But it feels like in the past there has been some addictions, some obsessions, some lies, some deceit, some sabotage. And you are being called to let it all go. So there could be somebody that returns to your life that you may need to really think twice about, okay, with that choose wisely card. Be careful what you choose because what you own owns you. But there is potential for it to be successful. I see that happiness should be coming because you've been through some turmoil. I mean, there's been turmoil here. And the turmoil has been caused by your impulsive choices, okay, in love, all right? And now you have the opportunity for new love to come in. Or I think it could be somebody you know, though. I think it could be somebody that you know. I think there's an opportunity for somebody that you know, whether you dated them or not, I don't know. It could be somebody from your childhood to come into your life and you may be tempted to act impulsively again. This is tempted and this is impulsively. Okay, you may be tempted, but you're being called to really think about this. Really, really think about this because this person who is offering you love has... You know, they've they've hurt you before in some way, okay? And it feels like it's time for a change, okay? It's time for a transformation. It's time for you to begin again. So this is a new beginning. So I feel like for many of you, there's a chance for a renewal here, whether it's with somebody that you're with or somebody that is coming into your life, there's a chance for a renewal in love if you choose to accept it, okay? But I think that you are, you know, you've cut, there's a, there's a death of an idea up here. So there's like a, maybe it's your negative thinking. Maybe you have to let go of your negative thinking so this renewal can happen, okay? Maybe you've been deceiving yourself. I don't know. So anyway, Sagittarius, I feel like there are some hurdles in your life that you have brought on to yourself, and I'm sorry to say that. For some of you, there's addictions that are holding you back. For some of you, you're sabotaging your own self by thinking you're, you're sabotaging the love of your life by thinking negatively. For some of you, um, it's time for a renewal, and it could be successful, and it's up to you. It's up to you with how you perceive the situation. I feel like you are being called to look at this in a new light. So if somebody is offering you love, really, really look at it in a new light, Sagittarius. Okay? Whatever has happened in the past, it's the past. It happened to open your eyes. All right? Um... So that's what I have, Sagittarius, for your spirit message. It's time for a transformation, and it has to do with your thoughts. Your thoughts become things. Replace negative with positive, and you will receive love. That is your message. <laughs>